For me, the main advantages of the TLX implant are the same surgical cassettes and drilling protocol as for the BLX, the TL neck for better soft tissue healing and less risk of periimplantitis. I also think for the prosthetic dentist it's a very easy access and a similar protocol compared to the tissue level implants that they are used to use. And last but not least, for the patient, it reduces the amount of surgeries and the components needed, which makes it far more accessible. My experience so far with TLX, I have placed the TLX implant almost as soon as it came on the market. My experiences so far are that the osseointegration is superb. The workflow is straightforward and even in very challenging cases, the outcome is terrific. I could help patients that were impossible to treat with other implants because of the combination of the strength and the stability of this implant, making people with compromised oral situations very happy with their new functional and aesthetic good-looking teeth. Will the TLX implant replace other Strowman implants in my practice? Yes, it might replace some BLX and TL implants, but I also see new indications. Why not start with immediate loading with overdentures? I believe that TLX has the potential to become the standard implant for immediate treatment in the premolar and molar region and in edentulous cases where there is no need for angulation. The BLX I use for the aesthetic regions and the angular indications. So we have now the whole portfolio that is complete. And with the new TLX implant in mind, I think that this could add up a lot more cases per year in my practice.